What is Fluxus? A loosely coordinated group of artists scattered around the world, Fluxus was particularly well represented in New York. Like the Dadaists and Futurists before them, Fluxus artists rejected the notion that museums had the right to determine the value of a work of art and that one had to be educated to view and appreciate it. Fluxus wanted everyone to constantly create art and make it accessible to the general public. It can be difficult to define Fluxus because, according to many Fluxus artists, it would be too restrictive and reductive. Fluxus sought to change not only the history of art, but also the history of the world, unlike previous art movements. Most Fluxus artists remain committed to the erasure of all distinctions between art and life. Fluxus was an anti-art movement. An important principle of Fluxus was to find all necessary means to make art accessible to the general public while mocking the exclusive world of high art. Along with Dada, Fluxus is one of the few art movements to have used humor in the history of art. Fluxus artists used humor to convey their intentions. Fluxus artists were serious about changing the distribution of power in the art world, despite their playful behavior. Their disdain for high art affected the way people perceived the authority of the museum to decide what constituted art. Fluxus art involved the viewer and depended on chance to determine the final outcome. Dada, Marcel Duchamp and other performance artists of the time, such as Happenings, also used chance in their work. The ideas of John Cage, who believed that one should begin a piece without having any idea of its purpose, had the greatest impact on Fluxus artists. It is the process of creation, not the final product, that matters. Although Fluxus is best known for its organized events and performances, its artists also produce more plastic art forms such as flux kits, prints and films. Previously, these works were not signed because Fluxus artists felt that the artist's ego should not be present in the artwork. Therefore, all pieces must now be signed simply Fluxus. You can find videos about Fluxus artworks in this playlist. If you like the video, leave us a like and feel free to share it. Subscribe so you don't miss our future videos. Thanks for watching. See you soon on Art Theory.